What's up, guys? Ryan Reese here. Um, woke up this morning and was happy to find an article about one of my athletes here, Demetrius Bronson, uh, freshman running back for UW. Um, he's actually, like, his name is, go ahead and show you, headlighting the, the front page here. And um, this is April 14th's paper, um, Tuesday, of the Seattle Times. And uh, it talks about how he's worked his way up. Um, from kind of coming in and being unknown to the bottom, you know, bottom of the of the list, and now he's he's at the top. Uh, he's he's really putting in a lot of work and impressing the coaches. Uh, he's stronger than all the other running backs. Um, he's just as fast, if not faster, um, and the coaches are finding that out. Um, a little bit about Dem uh, Demetrius is that he. Uh, he uh, couldn't get in academically, um, some eligibility, more or less his eligibility problems, and so he had to sit out. Um, he had a gray shirt, so which means like you're potentially still on the team. You're still you know in the process of of qualifying to get in, so he had to sit out. He couldn't even go to school. He didn't even practice, didn't train, couldn't do any of that stuff. And so he actually uh, came in here and just worked his butt off and did what he needed to do to get in. And, uh, you know, a lot of times players at that point, they either give up or they push harder and, and they're, they're successful. And that's, you know, the two options he had. And he, he went harder than I've ever seen anybody. I mean, this guy did his, did his work that he needed to do as far as for academics. And then he came in here sometimes twice a day, you know, in the morning, 5 a.m., coming in here doing sprints, working on his speed, working on his, his, you know, his running form, his footwork, I mean, all this stuff. And then in the evening, he'd come in, and uh, he would do the resistance training. I mean, this guy was a beast in here, and he was so motivated. There was nothing you couldn't tell him that he couldn't do. I mean, so, you know, what happened then is, like, when he got in, finally he reported into winter ball. And um, so, they, you know, they, they tr you did weight training, and then you did a lot of speed work. And he broke records. As a freshman at 18 years old, he broke records for running backs, okay, which that surprised the coaches. I mean, this guy was, was squatting more weight than anybody even thought. I mean, people are just like, "Are you still going up?" He's like, "Yeah, I'm going up. You know, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna squat 5:45." And he actually could have squatted a lot more, but the trainer actually stopped him because he just didn't want him to get hurt, which is a smart thing. He did three max lifts, and so um, and the same thing with the bench. I mean, he broke records again. It's just surprising a lot of people. And then, you know, so he's a beast in the weight room. They want to see what he had on the field. And, again, all the work he put in here at Apparel Fitness translated, you know, into he's just as fast, if not faster, than everybody else out there. I mean, really just impressing the coaches. Spring ball comes around, you know, and he's worked his way up to the top of the depth charts now. I mean, the coaches are just amazed by what he can do. And what happened was Demetrius set goals. Now I have a blog. Uh, on blogger.com where I just talked about goals and Demetrius is one of those guys he sets goals and he reaches them he works hard and does everything he needs to do to get to that goal so he did everything he needed to do to get stronger he did everything he needed to do to get faster and what was the end result right here on the paper I mean impressing the coaches killing it okay so if you're an athlete if you're a parent of a young athlete or even a coach you know there's something to be said you know Players come in here, they get stronger, they reach their goals, they go to their pro other programs when they move on, and or they get noticed to be able to move on to that to um, a college program and they kill it. So if you have any questions, you know, I would just really urge you just come down, you know, talk with me a little bit, see the facility, and um, you know, see what I have to offer. You know, see what I'm doing differently. Because there's a lot in here that I'm doing that I know other players aren't doing. Okay? So, and what that's translating to is stronger athletes, healthier athletes. Okay? Big thing. Healthier athletes and faster athletes. Not only that, the atmosphere, you can't match it. There's no atmosphere like I have in my gym. Kids come in here and they know it's serious business. Okay? So give me a call, 206 300 uh, you can also email me at imperialminded at gmail and uh, you know just set up an appointment with me we can talk you come down see what the program's about see how the gym looks and uh, we go from there um, so you know just take note things big things are happening in here you know so 
Um, that's all I have to say. Set some goals, you know, and then really ask yourself, am I doing everything possible to get to this goal? Am I really working as hard as I possibly can? All right? Uh, until next time, guys, talk to you later.